Let's start. Today we will see, how to plot the multi-timeframe center of gravity indicator in the TradingView Pine script. This is an indicator function with a name, the multi-timeframe center of gravity. First, we use the input.timeframe function to accept the user input for the higher timeframe. The default value is the daily timeframe. Here we have used the COG function, which stands for center of gravity function. The first argument of the function is the source type, and the second argument is the length. Then we have used the security function to get the higher timeframe data. The first argument is the current stock name. The second argument is the higher time frame. The third argument is the center of gravity of the current time frame. The bracket 1 written in front of the current time frame center of gravity avoids the indicator repainting issue. The indicator repainting issue is discussed in one of our previous tutorials. The link to that video is given in the description. The fourth argument handles the gaps. And the last argument handles the bar merge. Finally, we have plotted the higher time frame center of gravity. Let's add this indicator to the chart. As you can see we are on a 5 minutes chart right now, and we have plotted the daily time frame center of gravity. We can go to the input, and change the time frame. Now we are looking at the 30 minute center of gravity. So that's it. That's how you can plot the multi time frame center of gravity indicator in the TradingView Pine script. Thank you.